This thing has been breaking the sound barrier for 7,000 years. It's been happening as long as the world existed. Okay, and I've got some stuff. Nice. Whoopee cushion, mega fast. It's a tiny whoopee cushion, isn't it? I want to show you the extremes of science. One, two, three, go. The second largest whoopee cushion on earth. Beautifully done. Now Robin's gonna sit down on this just like it's a normal chair. You lot are gonna watch the business end here and see what happens, you know, see what we get. Heel to heel, bum to bum, back to back, and land! Don't say it. That went right on my nose. <laughs> Three. <laughs> Now we'll have a look, you know, there's a big difference in our sizes, but let's see what happens. Turn to the person next to you, say hello, and do the same thing. Do it at that disc while I count to 20 seconds. Three. Ah. It's got to be thumb to thumb, little finger to little finger. Mississippi one, Mississippi two. I don't always look like a sumo wrestler, really, do I? And rub up and down, just like I'm doing now. I just want you to consider, if we're doing this in the name of science, a sumo wrestler. Does that feel a bit weird? Does that feel a bit odd, a bit strange? Yes, yes, yes we have a nod here, we have a nod here, and we have a nod there. Mississippi 3, Mississippi 4. <laughs> Mississippi 5, Mississippi 6. Hey, fresh! Fresh Mississippi 19, Mississippi 20. So that my centre, all of this stuff can move from all the way over here to all the way over here, and I don't fall over. Stop! Up and out. <laughs> you tire a tiny bit of your brain out so that when you look at the heads, you've not got your whole of your brain there, a little bit tired and not working quite properly. And that gives you the illusion. You got a head expanding experience there. We blew somebody's head up like I promised you we would. <laughs> but uh, what did you see the Did it work? Were you getting? Hey, give us a little cheers around. 